guys, this is James Bonnie Videos here. Um, today I'm gonna be reviewing the let's see, yeah, the Nerf Firefly. This is the gun I'm reviewing today. Um, okay, so I'm gonna be normal review with the goods, yeah, the goods and the bads, and of course I'm gonna do a firing test. Um, okay, so let's start out with the goods. Um, the first good is that um. It has a revolving barrel, so it isn't like, um, it isn't like, um, the strike fire, where you would have to go like this. For example, you would, so with the strike fire, you would have to go like this. It isn't like that, um, like this, it has a revolving barrel, so for what you would, the only thing you would have to do because since it's a revolving barrel, so you would just have to um, see the darts in there. You cock it once, fire it. Cock it another time, fire it. You can do that, and then you have eight shots. Um, this is an eight dart revolving barrel right here, as I said before. The next good is, is it, has, it has one tactical rail. It has one tactical rail, and um, I'm actually kind of surprised about that. Because this is like one of the first Nerf guns, as far as I know, that was in, that came out. And I'm actually kind of surprised that they even put a tactical rail on it. The next good is if you're fighting like in the dark, um, it has like a little switch right here. And you switch it on and this little red light turns on. Um, um, so, look at this. Um, so, when you press the trigger the light flashes. So you're having like, so, so if you're having like a Nerf war in the dark, you can use that. Um, the next good about this gun is it ha, it, again, it has eight darts up here. And it also has another, you can also store another eight darts, um, back right here and here. You can, um, it has like these little holes right here. You can store darts in each one of these, um, so that there's eight on either side of here, and then you can also store another eight darts up here in the revolving barrel. So that's a total of 16 darts. So if you're running around, you have 16 darts, which is great. If you're running around, you can if you have eight, you have 16 darts, so you don't have to go and pick up darts up the field for quite a while. Um, um, the last good about this gun is it has like these two like holding things right here, the two little of these things. So then you can attach like the bandolier kit or the deploy strap, whatever your hand has, um, whatever you have. Um, okay, so um, um, the next, the f um, and the final good about this gun is for its size, it shoots incredibly far. Um, I know that it shoots around like 35 feet, so it's amazing. Um, I'll, you'll, we'll see, we'll have to see how far it exactly shoots. Okay, so that's all the goods, now on to the bads. Um, the first bad about this gun is the trigger. You have to pull it back really far, see, so look at this. See, so look. See, so just fired. So, uh, you have to pull the trigger back that far. And it extends up that far. It's so like, wait, let me sh let me do that again. So this time I'll have a dart. I'll have a dart in it. See, look at the trigger. That's see, just fired out. Um, that's how far I to pull it, right there, and it goes out all the way like this. So yeah. Um. The next bad about this gun is the batteries. Right here, you have to put in batteries in order for that flash to work. Um, you have to put, if the batteries are not included. I think you have to put in three AA batteries. And let me see, one second. Actually, I don't know. Uh, I think it's three AA batteries. Um, the next bad about this gun is, you have to pull, it's kinda hard to pull a cocky mechanism back. But the thing is, um, after you've played with it for a while and pulled this back, like, when you're playing with it, after you've played with it for a little while, like a few months, then eventually this kind of, get, this gets loose, and then eventually it gets really easy. And 
and then you can, and then it's really easy to do. See, look at this. Yeah. Um. And the thing is, is I got the yellow one. Um. If you were to go like on eBay or Amazon or something, you'd finally find, you'd probably find like the blue one, which is really old. And that one with the cocking mechanism, that cocking mechanism, is really hard to pull back. And it never like loosens up on the blue one. Or the yellow one, this one, it loosens up after a few months. Um, that's all the bads for this gun that I can think of at the moment. Um, oh, and one more good. This, this stock, it fits, it fits really snug up against my shoulder. Just the way I like it. Um, see? It feels, it fits really snug. Yeah, um, so... Now on to the firing test. I'll see you guys then. Bye. Okay guys, so I'm just about to do the firing test. I have um, a firefly here. I'm gonna fire one Whistler dart um, into the bathroom right there, down at the end of the hall. All the way down there. Um, here, holding it straight, firing it in three, two, one. Crud. That fired a long, that fired quite a long way. Okay, I'll put the gun while, while we're on stand, standing so I know where to measure from. Okay, guys, so, um, I'll see you guys later with the numbers and the dart. Um, let me show you where it landed. See the dart? It landed just right about here, and then it bounced, it hit, like it came in like this. Then it bounced off right there, and then it landed in the tub. Um, so it landed right about there. And then, I can't see the gun on the camera, but I'm zooming in, you'll see it. Right there, that little thing right there. Okay, and then, right, it's right in there. Um, and then all the way over here. Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna measure it out. See you guys later, and bye. Okay guys, so I measured it out. Um, so I shot this firefly with this Whistler dart. Fired it. I fired it. Um, okay, and it fired, wait one second. It fired, this is my little like measuring tape thing. See, it's flashing, the number. Um, you see, this is like a really advanced tape measure. See the wheels? You roll it along the floor and then it tells you how far it went. Um, it, the firefly firing the Whistler dart fired exactly 31 feet and one inch. Wait, 31 feet, one inch, and then one sixteenth of an inch. Yeah, um, okay. Hope you guys heard that. Um, because I just reset it. So now I don't know where it went. Okay, so that this has been James Honey Videos, the Nerf Firefly Review. See you guys later and bye.